And we're back to Civilization 5. I am well and truly addicted. I can't get enough of the game, but we have pretty much secured victory, the cultural victory, which we were going for all along. So, so much for all you guys telling me I'm a noob, etc, etc. But it seems like that's the standard response I get from people in my Civilization 5 Let's Plays, but somehow I've managed to win and win in the way that I've wanted to so far, so I'm happy with that, even though we only play on normal difficulty. But you know you're doing well when the game's telling you that victory is pretty much imminent. Uh, we've saved up until the next turn where the World Congress will convene. Let's go tell these guys to get to work because I'm pretty sure I've got two slots left. I should just check her out before I was recording, so in Braga. And then no doubt Porto's... No, where is Porto? Over here. So it's building the Opera House at the moment. That's all good. Turn over into the next turn where the World Games will be built. Or at least voted upon. Our people are now buying your blue jeans. We've already said that to every civilization, haven't we? Apart from Morocco. Morocco were the poor suckers that declared war on us first. What did we declare? I think, I'm pretty sure they declared war on us. But it serves them right though. So does Portugal. They completely backstabbed us and <laughs> they got what was coming to them and because of them, we've won. So, Warsaw. I don't think I really want to build anything with Warsaw at the moment. So let's go back right now. The 6th Venice Conference, and we want to enact the International Games, where the winner will get a tourism increase by 100% for 20 turns. So if we get that, I think we could win within 20 turns. That'll be damn good. Let's commit the delegates. Okay. And now Warsaw. We'll just settle on research for now. Going to the next turn. Oh, archaeology. And we should be able to get the two extra Russian artifacts as well. Actually, I need to slow this down, don't I? Where are we? These guys. Just cancel your mission. I only need to cancel these guys' mission. Let's see. Two turns for you. And for you, you've also got two turns. I'll just tell you to hang back. Because we're going to run out of space. I'll dig wherever I want. You can't do anything about it. Sucks to be you. Ha ha ha. Russia. I guess it's a sweet, sweet victory against Russia. Because after all, they are wearing Polish blue jeans and dancing around to our pop music. <laughs> that is the sweetest victory of all. Russia. I don't care if we lose anymore. As long as Russia is under our influence. And the international games have passed. It's our turn to make another proposal. Why is that? Let's close this again. Let's go to Porto and International Games. Warsaw. Change production International Games. Back off, we'll go with Tangier International Games as well. Then we'll go with Marrakesh once once it, once it gets the Christo, Christo Redentor. For bat as well. Okay. Krakow as well next turn. So let's go something else. Probably the world. No, we don't want the world's fair. I definitely don't want to help people with um culture. The other sieves. Science is funding. They'll all be angry at us. Seems like they're all going for cultural victories as well. Uh, historical landmarks. Let's just go with something dumb. Let's go with... I actually don't want to get on the bad side of Venice. Let's go with... Doesn't really bother me. No one's really getting get angry. Let's commit the proposal, even though it'll help Russia. It's all good. Pedro II is secretly plotting against Guy and Marta. They're always having fun there, aren't they? Now Lisbon. Porto is the guys that needed... I think... Whatever. Let's go with 
the international games as well. Purchase, museum, might as well, right? So then we can tell our other guys to get to work. These guys. These guys as well. Cargo ship to go to... where we should go it doesn't really matter really anymore whatever it doesn't matter because well i just need to go ahead and trade with any civilization and that's it okay you guys are done it's all good we're making 207 tourism 56 28 turns against brazil so we've definitely won there's no doubt Finish this dig. Let's go get a Russian artifact. All right, so that's it with Russia. They're probably going to get quite angry at us. They've only got like one antiquity site left. So I haven't even discovered all of this area. And we're going to win without it. So I'll tell you just to come up around here. Uh, so in the meantime... Everyone loves us, Bratislava. Uh, Marrakesh in the next turn. Let's just keep on trying to get the world games up and running. Very well. You can denounce me all you'd like. Surprise they denounced us. We worked with you. With the World Congress. And that's going to convene in 20 turns. Up oh, Brazil's denounced Venice. Very nice of Brazil to have done that. Always very understanding, though, aren't they? Come to me, all who labor and are heavy burdened, and I will give you rest. Culture cost of adopting new policies reduced by 10%. So four more turns until the next policy. And then with that major production cities, we'll go ahead and also get the World Games, and then we've won. I wonder how long it lasts for the World Games. Let's go ahead and get the Polish Artifact. Oh, that gave us four points. I'm just going to keep on checking back. It's down to 50 turns now and 25. There's still 18 that are undiscovered. I wonder how you have to discover them. I mean, there's this one. We already know where one of them is. But I'm not really going to send out anyone else, I don't think. It's going to take too long. To do all that. Let's see, anyone else going to finish anything? Nope. Gonna have a couple of hotels out. They'll help us with tourism again. I really feel bad for all the other civilizations. They're just so behind us now. There's no way that they can catch up. Rabat's grown. They can also work on the international games. Wish you could check up on all of this stuff. Pedro loves us. Oh, Catherine's reached a thousand points as well. We're in 2016 though. We've definitely pulled out ahead again after we've captured all the Portuguese cities. Uh, it wouldn't hurt to be friends with a bit more civs. Maybe we'll go with, let's see. Panama City. 62. 107, 57. 360 with Melbourne. Uh, 52. 58. They're both militaristic. Although you want dyes and a road constructed between our capitals. Don't we already have that? I need to improve that road. That's what I need to do. Or just improve that. So I'll give you a gift. You know what? Go into the next turn and then we'll improve this tile finally. After all this time. I guess that tile wasn't all that important though. 
We finally completed the Statue of Liberty. Which isn't really an issue. Oh, hello. It almost looks like they've settled on two tiles or so. Three. Oh. We love the King Days ended. Let's go ahead and go with Venice. Give us a nice boost. Uh, dyes, whales, and citrus. Okay, I guess I must have traded all the citrus. Definitely start a golden age. Which will help us out greatly. Repair and improvements. Still 217 tourism. Marrakesh has got 78 defense. The most heavily defended city. I wonder how much Venice has got. 100. It's very well defended. And Brussels 126. Which defies all logic. Anyways, it's not like defense is all that important. So, what I'll do... Come back up over here. Uh, I'm sure Enrico... Won't really want to do anything with us. Check. I guess horses and iron don't hold any sway at the moment, though. I might as well give him a bit of oil. He doesn't even want that. That's cool. Actually, what I'll do is let's have a closer look at how much his people will hate him. Oh, here we go. Wow, he's getting minus 24 for choosing freedom. And still, Russia and Indonesia haven't even gotten to the point of choosing an ideology. Good stuff. It would be pretty dumb for Venice to attack us. And they're even trading with us as well. Quite a long trade route. Smolensk. Smolensk is definitely very, um, it reminds me of something. It must, must have been like a uh, massive battle between Poland and Russia or something in Smolensk. I don't know, it just reminds me. Maybe it was in Company of Heroes 2, a mission in Smolensk or something. It just seems to run in memory. Uh, but let's have a closer look. Oh, you can't really see. It's 42% complete. That's cool. Will also contribute here. So we've complete contributed two thousands production at the moment, which seems like we would have completed the most, really. I mean, we've got wads next, and then what else? Bears, I guess. And then quite literally all of our cities in Embraga and then all our cities are working on it, so we should have won. It's already halfway complete. And we are some of the most literate people. The future. I just completely clicked through way too many things way too quickly, didn't I? Apologies for that. I don't think I really want another tenant. I'm not really going to purchase any more buildings. And I don't really care about that. So what I'll go for is... We'll get extra science from 661 to 660... Or 677. Alright, and because we went up in age as well. Chairman Casimir. Very communist -y sounding. We'll go with... Quantity of resources gifted by gifted by city states increased by 100%. Happiness from gifted luxuries increases by 50%. Okay, simple enough. And we can choose some new military techs. Probably go with. Might as well just go with rocketry or something. So we can just get the most basic stuff done. Oh, I need to All right, we've got a spy. 
Marion. So Marion, I'm going to let's see. I think Valessa. So I can work our magic there. We only need 56 influence, so it's not that bad. And they should really like us because we haven't built a. I'm sure we've built a road. In X from Warsaw all the way to Casablanca through to Valletta. That looks complete. Anyway, you guys go back to automatic improvements. Next turn it is. Oh, wow. But they're still in triremes, which are pretty far back techs, aren't they? It's 1980. Jeez, rushes behind. I guess it serves them right for building so many cities and only being on one continent, really. I wonder how many cities they've got. Oh, damn. So we got 88 points from cities. They get 120. Must have a ridiculous amount of cities. But if that's what they want, that's what they want. I'm not going to argue. Ah, here we go. The Polish cargo ship now. So now they literally look like cargo ships. I think it might have changed in 1980, this turn. And so we've got all our cargo ships, but what we can get are trucks. If we go over here, our caravans, they look like those big rigs. You're our truck simulator style. But we're going to settle for international games as well. So we can get all of that a little bit quicker. Okay. Oh, Hong Kong. <laughs> what do you know? They're allied with Venice. Must say I'm not surprised. Come over here. Does it make sense that Rush is near ice and the northern side of the map? getting culture very quickly 11 turns until another social policy we would have already won the social victory or culture victory because there's no doubt that we would have had let's see yeah, five extra we've got 10 extra um things that we've gotten so we would have won already if we were playing in the old style of Ultra victory, but of course we're not as we work on the international games again as well. I'm sure the international games should be finished very shortly. Should have a closer look at Ultra now as well. Ah, here we go. Wow. Wow. We beat everyone by so much. So athletes representing civilizations from around the world have gathered to compete in feats of strength, skill, and grace. As the world watches civilizations rise to glory with each medal earned in the international games. The project requires a total of 5,760 production between all civs to be completed. High contributions earn more rewards. Now we're producing 450 culture 14 turns until we win. So next episode. And I can choose a free social policy. So we'll go with the Merchant Confederacy. Confederacy. Doesn't really help us out all that much. But at least we finished patronage. And now we're going to have to choose something to build in all of our cities. Which is exciting. Might as well all be happiness stuff. Warsaw, Medical Lab. It does not matter at all what we build because we've won. Because we've got the bonus for 20 turns. 14 turns, what the hell? 
That's next episode. That went by really quick. Uh, I'm just really clicking indiscriminately. Might as well get a hotel in Porto. That's everything done. Seems like everyone loves us because we ho hosted the um, games. What a place to look. Friends with everyone. Very cool indeed. Although no new allies. There's the other bastards have beaten us. We're gonna, let's actually have a closer look. Valletta 24. Okay. Let's buy Valletta out. Give him a thousand gold. Sophia. 33. We don't have a quest either, so I'll just settle. Might as well go get Prague. Yeah, there we go. And wow, 69 happiness as well. That is ridiculously good. The World Games. I guess I couldn't go with Olympic Games. Because after all, the Olympic Games are nothing but more but a commercial entity these days. They're not about sporting excellence or anything like that. Olympic Games are really a massive joke these days. Okay, we connected dyes. You're doing really well. Cargo ships. Let's go with uh oh, Ross. I'll connect to a city state. Let's go to Rostov. Let's explore up around here. Oh wow. Like a bay around here or something. And flat's going to be complete. 755 science. Brazil is denounced Indonesia. What would you expect? Still trading everything. So I, I'm definitely going to end this Let's Play after we finish it. I don't think there's really a point in carrying on. Otherwise, it'll be just uh, pretty dumb, really. I connect to Brasilia. And then you come ahead and explore all the way. Oh, Vladivostok. Oh, there's another antiquity site. Ah. Talk about city overkill. I'm not quite sure what the Russians were thinking. Sort of just wanted to go destroy him. I want I'd be really interested to see. I guess because it is Russia, we should. I'm not going to declare war on anyone. Uh, Germany's cities are so poorly defended. They're just asking for a problem. Aeronautics. Wow. I influence over Valletta's gr growing a lot. A great engineer. Go ahead and just hurry up production there, mates. Alright. That's why I... Uh, Influence over Valletta is so large now. Because we rigged the elections. Like the corrupt bastards that we are. Still in a golden age, no doubt. Four more turns. Alright, we've got another antiquity site here. I can't buy archaeologists, so let's see. Marrakesh is finishing the stadium off in a turn. Gotta find if I've got any more spots left though. And the game's changed so much now. Everyone loves us. Let's go over to here. Ten more turns, three turns until Brazil is in our grasp. Oh wow, and that's it. For the art slots. Alright. 
Okay. Well, that's it, folks. Unless, wait. Porto. You've already got the museum, haven't you? Yep. All right. Uh, so, we can't really go get another archaeologist. It'd be pretty pointless. Definitely go get the research lab. Whereas you... Then you go build me... I'm not really sure what I wanted to get built. I've gotten everything that I really want. Castleblank and Porto with some markets. Might as well get a castle. And then Wads Broadcast Tower. Golden Age is ending three turns. And I'm pretty sure. Okay, of course I'm going to accept that. We get the. Well, I don't really need the bonus with Russia anymore, but it's always nice to have it. Pretty sure Brazil's going to fall to our glory and might very shortly as well. And then it's just the dastardly Venice. Venetians. Okay. Guy Amada. I'm sure we'll want to trade later on, though. Let's go build the zoo. There's some extra happiness. Warsaw, build me a stadium. And Tangier. Going for things that are going to take the longest to build, to be honest. Oh, we found the Great Barrier Reef. So that's two tiles, is it? But the Great Barrier Reef would have like would have been like any other natural wonder. I guess not. This island is incredibly small though. It's like Fortaleza. Why? It's just a waste of the city. Because all it'll really give you is, will penalize you for like your happiness and all that. that punish you with science as well from all your cities, I think, is how it works. Let's go settle with Brussels because I can. Andrew Bat, build me a medical lab. Crack of. I mean, Arsenal. All right. 454 culture. Wow. Brazil, 989. Next turn, eh? Yep. And then Venice, eight turns. 146% influence over Russia now. We've almost dominated Indonesia. Dominance at 200%. Oh, wow. Even more cities. Okay, I'll tell this frigate to come ahead and explore over here, although the game's going to be over by then, which I'm cool with. Maybe I should upgrade some more of my units. But this will be the last turn for this episode. Then we've got one final one, which will be a bit sad because I definitely enjoyed this Let's Play. Hopefully you guys have as well. Of course, it died off in the end a bit. I'm not too happy, but I guess... That's what happens with my channel, at least. Okay. Your golden age ends. We've got another session. With five turns. And then your culture only needs to become influential with one more civilization to win a culture victory. Got a heck of a lot of happiness. And still Russia and Indonesia. Much behind us. Only with 16. How much tourism do the other guys produce? 34 and 35. Wow. And we've got 454. Seven turns left. So, until next time, guys. I'll see you later. In seven turns, this game will be all over Red Rover. And we'll have a new splash screen for the